The Comptroller General of Customs Bashir Adewale Adeni on Thursday 18th July 2024 took another remarkable step towards widening the horizon for Nigeria Customs Services global recognition as he paid an official visit to the United States of America. The CGC's visit to the United States US was aimed at meeting the strategic stakeholders within the security and diplomatic agencies in the country to foster bilateral relationship between the Nigeria Customs Service and the US. The meeting focused on reviving the over a decade old Customs Mutual Assistance Agreement CMAA to enhance the service delivery through global collaborations and data-driven decision-making to improve national security and effectively combat cross-border crimes. Speaking to Rabbi Lowell of the Nigerian Embassy in the United States of America at his office, CGC Adeni appreciated him and his team for their warm reception and tireless efforts towards all the Nigerians in the diaspora. Uh, there is a subsisting uh, memorandum of understanding, uh, which was just a basic uh, you know, instrument to provide a legal framework uh, for customs to customs cooperation uh, in a number of uh, issues. And uh, I was part of the original uh, process that led us into signing that when I was much younger officer. And uh, I see a lot of benefits, potential uh, benefits that that kind of cooperation uh, can be. Uh, in my one year of uh, duty as Controller General, uh, we have benefited extensively from such collaboration with other customs administrations, uh, with other you know, international partners. Uh, it has helped us to make fantastic seizures, like possibly those arms and ammunition that we have heard about. Uh, there is a lot of opportunities for us in the integration of technology into our operations. Uh, so that was why I felt we could uh, renew friendship and uh, explore frontiers of cooperation with the, with the CDP. The CGC who intimated him about his efforts in addressing the challenges of cross-border crimes to ensure national security also briefed him about his visit to the United States Customs and Border Protection CBP, where he made James Collins the Assistant Commissioner of the Office of International Affairs. The meeting also covered the challenges of commercial air cargo security and potential partnerships with the U.S. government. I assure you, the embassy will follow off all the engagement you had with your counterparts. So what about the new development updates? Our head of our political will let you know what is happening. And if there is need for additional uh, information from your own side, we also communicate so that to let the uh, host know the new development. Muhammad Bashir, NCBN, Abuja.